What's up, YouTube? CJD here from Chris's Junkyard Designs. Just gonna do some random cars I got over the past few weeks that I haven't made a video on yet. Um, so I can get them pictures taken and cracked open on Instagram. There's just gonna be a whole bunch of different cars I got. I don't know if I'll get them all done in this video. And I still have to go through that other unboxing. I have another whole box of cars from um, TBC Auction. So that'll be the next couple videos probably. Now we'll start off with this. Custom 41 Willys Coupe. Beautiful color green. Love this casting. I've got to do a custom on one of these. I haven't done one yet. I really haven't gotten an extra. I think I do have an extra now, though, to do one. So, the beautiful body lines on these cars. Love it. This one's really nice. This one might get a wheel swap and some details done on it. But really cool. Okay, another casting I collect, a Triumph TR6. This is the blue variation of the number six. Blue and orange. Really cool. I like this casting. This has got the Fast and Ever wheels on it. Who is this one? This was 2011 for this one. Really cool. Okay, and then we have it in yellow. A yellow and goldish color really cool this got faster than ever as well and i'm sure this is 2011 too 2010 maybe 2010 yeah it's 2010 there's a little description of it 69 pretty cool i like when they do that i wish they still did that maybe description of the car in the back and those are the best i love it okay and if you watched my previous video. I talked about having this one I haven't opened yet. And here it is. The 84 Pontiac Stunt Car in blue. So I cannot wait to open this one and get it in the collection. I've been trying a while to get this car. <clears throat> very nice. Very nice paint color on there. I love it. can't wait to get this open. <clears throat> a couple more Olds Aurora's GTS ones. This might be a duplicate. I can't remember from the last ones I got. This is in the silver. I like this casting a lot. I have a few of these. It's nice lines on this race car. Very nicely done car. And I have it in a red. Variation. Same Hot Wheels livery. Same number one on the top, just in red. Really cool. It's an older one. What year is this one? This one is 99. Collector number 911. Sweet. Yep, that's an oldie. Okay. Let's get another stack out here. The Porsche Carrera. Collector number 829. That's got a lot of flake in that paint. Looks really nice. Heavy. Metal base for sure on this. Way how heavy it is. And this is 98. Really cool. I like the old Porsches they made. They're pretty cool. They're a little fat. A little wide, but I like them. Pretty cool. And we also have it in blue. Same car, just in blue. Very nice metallic blue. White interior. Metal base. And this is 2000. The number 146. And we got another one. Porsche Carrera. Extreme Speed Series. Pretty cool. Another metal base. Okay, graphics are all right. Definitely 90s or early 2000, 99. Collector number 967. On that one. Okay. Let's get the next round out here. Got these all in a box. Let me get the 81 DeLorean. Beautiful. Oh, it's got an opening rear hatch. Cool. 
don't know if the other DeLoreans I have have that. I didn't even check to tell you the truth. I have a gold one and a black one. I don't think they do, but I'm going to check it now. 2010. It says it right there. Oh, this one's got the description in the back, too. I love that. Ireland. Pretty cool. Snapshot that and read it if you want. And this one I've been trying to get for a while, too. The 56 Ford F100 and the Zamac. I have the other card ones, the two vans and the other 56 Ford in this, but I didn't have the Zamac, so... I like this casting too. Um, I don't go nuts over this casting. It depends on what the livery is and what the design looks like. I don't get every single one because there are some uh, crazy looking ones I don't like. But this one is really awesome. Zamac, of course. So, very nice car. 2020 on that one. This one's sweet. 70 Plymouth Superbird in yellow. This one's nice. It's 2011. This one is really nice. I can't wait to get this in the collection. I have a lot of Dodge Daytonas, not a whole lot of Superbirds. So I have some on eBay I'm looking f towards getting. Um, it's the description on the back. I'm really trying to get the one that's like that teal blue color. With the reddish rims, not the supercharger on because that thing's way too expensive for me. But they had a regular version of it, too, that I really want to get. Because I have a diorama I'm going to set up with four other treasure hunt um, race cars that I changed the wheels out on detail. And I want to add that to it. So I'm looking on eBay. I'm trying to get a good deal on one. Because I haven't been able to find it anywhere else. So here's another DeLorean. 2018 50th anniversary. This one's sweet. Dark gray. Very nice. Car is just a regular card in the back. Okay, and then we got this Nissan 300 ZX twin turbo. I did not have this variation. I missed it somehow. But I do now. In the red. This is sweet. I do collect this casting. Very nicely done car. Very nicely detailed. A lot of these GDMs, the factory freshes, you can just do a wheel swap and you're set because they do full detail on these and it makes it look like a really nice car. I've done that on a few of them already. And here's another version I didn't have. This one's really nice. 2020, this color is beautiful. That pearl white again. Love it. Very nice car. This one might be getting a wheel swap. I like this with some real riders on it to see what I got. Very nice. I like that a lot. And okay. Let's get another stack out here. Going to some exotics now. Some higher end cars. I believe I have this one already. I'm not sure. I got these so cheap. I got them like 50 cents. So, I got this Bugatti Chiron. I'm not sure if I had the black or not. I can't remember. But, this is an awesome looking car. If I do have it, I'm going to real rider this one and detail it. And just leave it. And have it as a variation. <clears throat> and this one I don't have. This is the blue. So I got it now, though. 2019, nice car, look at that, nice casting, got that blue and black, and we got this vet, uh, Mercedes I mean, um, 16 Mercedes AMG GT3, this is a casting I collect somewhat, I mean if they're cheap enough, and I like the livery on it, design, I'll grab it, but this one was really cool. This is from 2018. I like it. It's got a nice color, nice silver, nice livery, nice wheels. Brings out the yellow lines in there on the wheels, which is nice. Ties it all together. So, very nice car. This is the bat. We got the C7 Z06 convertible. It's a casting I do collect too. I have a bunch of these. I did not have this Zamac. And what I really like about this is those rims. 
with that green, like a metallic green lip around it, which is awesome. I think that makes it right there. Oh, this is a really cool casting. I like it. I don't like convertibles too much, but I like this convor Corvette convertible. And they always have the headlights done up nice. I believe the taillights are done too. Yeah, really nice. Nice. Nice car. And here's the hardtop C7Z06. Another one I collect. Beautiful blue color. What a beautiful color. 2018. This one came out. Look at that. Very nice. What a beautiful car. Okay, and we have a Lamborghini Reventon Roadster. So I think I only have like one other variation of this. I have to go look at my Lambos. I have a ton of Lambos. Uh, this is a red edition. I did not have this. This looks really cool. So I got to see how many I have of this. It's either two or three. It's very nicely detailed on the inside, too. It's a nice molding. This would be a really good car to detail and throw some real riders on because it doesn't need much. It's basically done. So who knows? Maybe we'll do that in the future, too. Nice one. Nice red edition. Okay, more out here. And we got some Dodge Challenger drift cars. This is one I somewhat collect too. I don't get them all, but I've got a few of them. I think they're cool looking, and this livery is really cool looking. Very nicely done. So I have it in that color reddish color and I have it in blue I like the blue way better good rim choice I like it on both of them did really good picking that nice design nice color very nicely done oh this tells you about it too the back it will have the same thing I'm sure I like that they did that a lot between 2010 and 12, I believe. Putting what it was on the back, which I really like. Here is another one. Dodge Challenger Drift Car. Blue. Pretty cool design on the size of it. Mopar. I like the double wheel color, the yellow and the white. I think that's pretty cool. Brings out the tempo. This doesn't tell you anything on the back. What year is this? 14. Very nice. And I have that one. Another variation. It's not the same. No, it's not the same. So this is a different variation. This one's really cool, too. It's a nice red color. This has the two different wheels on it, too. Not as crazy about it on this one. But it's still cool. This is, what year is this one? 16. 2016, this one came out. Pretty cool. And we got this custom 15 Ford Mustang. Uh, my son likes to collect a lot of the modern Mustangs. I'm not into them too much. This one's really cool looking. The delivery on this one is really awesome. We don't have this one, so I like it. Very nicely done. Mean looking. Nice rims on it, too. Go great with this. Nice wheels. That's for 2016. Okay. Alright, now we got some tune cars. Surf and Turf's another one I collect. Did not have this one. Surf Shop. It's got like a little bit of the patina look on it. It's pretty cool. Pink. This is, this is a nice looking car. I like this one. You got the surfboard done up up top. Nicely done. I really want to do a custom on one of these. I have a couple extra. Um, this is 2018. Okay. Very nice. And this one I didn't have either. This one's really cool looking too. Excuse me, the two 
2018 too. Surfing on the top. Nice baby blue color with the orange glass. Looks good, I think, with it. I don't mind a different color glass on cars like these. Yep, 2018. I'm surprised that last one didn't have the 50th anniversary on the top. Usually all the 2018s do. Uh, but really, really cool. And I have this in a different color, red, I believe, but I did not have it in this color, and I like this color a lot better. So this is 2017. This is really nice with the wood panel design on it. I like that. Really nicely done car. Nice color. Nice wood grain. I like it. This casting I collect as well. The Tune 69 Camaro C28. I did not have this variation. I have about eight of them now, I think. This was one of the last tunes I got into. Um, the Dodge Daytona was the first one. I really liked that one. Um, but I think I have every single one now. I'm done. And, um... <laughs> The Mustang was the next one I got into. I have a lot of those. And now this is the one I got into. I don't like the Chevelle one. It was plastic looking ones. I'm not into those at all. But these three are the major ones. And the Lambo. Countach is another tuned one I have almost all of them of. So pretty cool. Nicely detailed. Neat designs on these. This is 2007. This one came out. <clears throat> We got this crazy looking thing. These are the hard nose. I also have one of these in a pickup truck too. I thought it was cool. I think I got it for a buck. I like the two-tone paint on it. The engine just sticking out a little bit. Not a whole lot. It's got a nice mean stance on it. Thought it was cool. It's the only one I have. I like it. Throw it in with the tune collection. And I got this guy. I believe this is my second variation of this. This is a tuned version. I forgot what car this represents. It's the Too Cool. That's right, the Too Cool. Um, and the other one was in 49 Merc. The Hard Nose 49 Merc. This one's cool. I like the color on this one. That's why I got it. Some of these are kind of ugly. Some of the colors they've made, which I don't like, but... This one I really like. This is 2004 for this one. Pretty cool. Okay, we're getting there. Glad I'm getting through all of these. It'll be a little bit of a longer video, but that's okay. Ford Falcon. Another collect casting I collect. 73 Ford Falcon XB. Awesome casting. I don't remember how many of these I got, but... Every one I get that I don't have, that's a pretty good price I snag. This is another one most people don't go for in the auctions, but I do. So I'll snag them up if I don't have it. That color, this one's really sweet. Look at this color, this nice black with those cool looking tampos on it. And the interior is even cool too with like that green color. And the rims I really like too. This is a very nicely done car. I can't wait to break this out of this stupid blister. It looks so much better. Guys, go on my Instagram page. I, I take pictures of every single one of these cars. Open from all different angles. And post them on there. So you guys can get a really good look at the car. Make sure you want it. If you like it or what it looks like. This is 2013. And here's another one in purple. Which is really sweet. That is an awesome metallic purple color. Beautiful rim choice on this one. Really, really like this one. Great job on this one. Very nicely done. Okay, and then we have the 73 Pontiac Firebird. I like an orange-red color. I don't have too many of the 73s. I don't know if they made too many of the 73s. Um, I'm not too much into the 69. I'm, I don't think that's good casting by Hot Wheels. It's, it, it's kind of weird looking to me. The 77, though, is my favorite. And I believe I have almost all of them. I finally have the red one coming with the flames. God, I've been trying to get that forever. I finally picked it up. But I cannot wait to get that one in the mail. But that'll be a while 
I'm gonna build a box with that one. This one's sweet. This is a beautiful color. I can't wait to break this one open. I believe I have three variations of this now. There's another one that tells you about the car. You wanna pause it and check it out. 2012 on that one. Another 73. Nice red metallic color. Beautiful car. I even like the rims on this one too. I think it goes good with it. The gold breaks it up. I like it. Very nicely done. Handles are done. Side markers are done. Just front and back isn't done. It's got side tampo treatment. And the hood. That's pretty cool for a dollar car. And this is 2016. This one here, I've been collecting it. It's not my favorite. 70 Pontiac Firebird. It's kind of weird. The newer version of this that just came out is a lot better. The engine shown. This is kind of clunky and big. I have like four of these now, but not the worst casting. You know, if I get them cheap enough, I'll grab it. The 50th anniversary. This was a whole set, I believe, of this livery. Uh, I have a few different ones. Uh, it's 2018. Here I did that. Okay. Now uh, we'll get into some Copo Camaros. 68 Copo Camaro. Sweet. This is another one. I don't get them all. I get it if I like the pattern on it. On this one, I definitely like with this metallic purple and orange flame pattern. It's awesome. The 70 Camaro is the one I really go after and try and get all the variations. But this one is really nice. Great job on this car. Beautiful color. And here's another 68 Copo. Nice green. Just the gloss green, no metallic in this one. It looks really good. I'm going to do the year on the last one. It should be the same year as this one. 2014. So, it's the same pattern, same everything, just different color. Okay. And another casting I go after, try and get them all, is the 85 IROC. Just an awesome casting. Beautifully done car. Very nice. I have a few of these, too. There's a few of them I want to get, but I haven't been able to nail a good price on them. They go for too much, but I'm patient. I can wait. Very nice. Nice red color. All right, now we're going to hit some Mustangs. This one's nice. 67 Shelby GT500. What a beautiful color. Blue. I did not have this variation. I have in two others. I don't remember what they are, but this is really cool. Uh, I have a ton of older Mustangs. I'm not, I gotta have close to probably 60 now. The older, between 65, 67, 68. All those. 70s. The Mach 1s. Awesome, awesome cars to collect. And there's a newer one from my kids' collection. Thought it was pretty cool. Actually, I think this came in a set with a couple other ones I had to buy it, but it's it's really cool looking with the yellow in the back. The yellow and the black and the yellow and the rims all ties together really nice. A nice one. Um, oh, that last one was, yeah, let me, let me show you. Hold on, I forgot to flip it around in case you're interested. 67 this is 2010. Yep, 2010. So check that out. And I believe this is a 2010 also. It is. So there you go. Read that. Pretty cool. Um, we got a Maverick shoved in there. So let's get that. I love collecting this casting too. Maverick. This is the custom Ford Maverick. I collect the custom and the regular Ford Maverick. This one's really nice. I have a lot of these. Very nicely done. Car looks cool. It's 2018. Okay. Now 
some more Mustangs. My favorite casting out of all the Mustangs they make is a 65 Fastback. That's the one I really love collecting the most. This is beautiful, this variation. Very nicely done car. I do not like the rims on this one at all, though. I don't think they go good with it at all, but I might leave it. We'll see. But the rest of the car is sweet. Red interior. Very nice. And this is 2011. That one. There's a 65 Mustang again. Another hatchback. Two plus two. Beautiful color on this one, too. Very nice. Rims aren't too bad on this one. Gray interior. And this is 2013. Very nice. And we have another Fastback with Fastener and Ever Wheels on it. It's silver. This is really sweet. I'm thinking I have this, but not in Fastener and Ever Wheels. I'm pretty sure. If I remember right, but once I saw it with Fast and Ever Wheels, I had to grab it. I'm not a big variation person, but I like the Fast and Ever Wheels if I can get them. This is another 2010. Let's check that out. Okay, uh, we got a Subi thrown in here in the end of my cars. At the bottom, I did not have this WRX version, STI, this variation. So WRX is one I kind of collect too. like the rims on this. They look sweet on there, I think. Nice color. Nice tampos. This is 2012. Wow, I didn't think they made that casting that long, but they did. Nice. Very nice. Okay, I believe the rest are bikes. So my bike collection has been growing a lot. Uh, I've been really picking them up for good prices on these auctions. Either people don't like them, or they have them, or what. But I've been grabbing them good. This is a Canyon Carver. I only have a couple of this bike, but these are really cool looking, I think. And these are always all metal, just about. Almost all of them are, so. Pretty cool. There you go. Another description on the back. I'm going to snap it and read it. And 2010. Is this casting. This little guy, I believe he threw in for free, if I remember right. Remember I got it from. That was a little stand. Um, I don't even know what it's called. I don't know. Yeah, it looks like a dirt bike. Pretty cool. Another one. There we go. The HW45 OF, I guess that's what it's called. And that's 2008. Okay, and we got this Dugatti. I just started getting these in my collection, so I have a couple of them now. Uh, before these ones that I got here. So that's pretty cool. Um, I've just been snagging them cheap, so I said, why not add them to the collection? Motorcycle collection. You can get a couple of these in each jammer section so you can collect a lot of these in one jammer which is really good Gotti, and here we go there we go another one really snapshot that and this is from 2010 okay another dugatti pretty cool thrill racer volcano pretty awesome Going a little bit here, we're almost on 30 minutes already. 2011. Nice. And I'm running out of room. Another Dugatti. White. Cool. Cool. And we looked at that. And it's 2011 on that one. And we're, this is the last group, guys, and we're done. Okay. This baby, OCC split back. Nice. Beauty. Nice. 
Peace, 2010. <clears throat> Sports and Scooter is one I do collect and try and get every variation. I did not have this one. I did have this, I believe, the same tan same um, livery, but in a different color. I believe it was blue or silver. I don't remember. Did not have this white one, though. Really cool. Heavy, heavy motorcycle. All metal, so there you go. Snag that. 2010 model. Another Scorch and Scooter. Nice teal color. Nice design on the seat. 2004. Old one. I've been making this one a while. Another one I collect. Try and get all the variations is Blast Lane. I like this motorcycle too. Another cool one. I actually have a couple more I bid on. I should be getting. I said these are something else hardly anybody bids on either. So I'll see snag these quick. There's an Airy 8. I have a couple of these. I think it's pretty cool too. 